Well, it is that time of the year again when we look out into the ocean, and sometimes mm -hmm. there's a red or brown color. In this week's What on Earth, meteorologist Marina Jurica tells us how red tide forms and how it affects us and the ocean. Southern California beaches are known for their beauty, but sometimes their luster can be spoiled by red tide. Red tide is caused by a bloom of phytoplankton. These microscopic plants naturally occur in our coastal waters, usually between early spring until late summer. Now a bloom occurs when it begins to reproduce very rapidly. Red tides are caused by dinoflagellates, which you can see right here, which produce toxins that can be harmful to marine life and humans. Now when can Conditions are just right. Warm, calm, and nutrient rich waters with lots of sunlight. These algae can multiply explosively, turning the water red or brown. Now, Here's something tricky. The color of the bloom depends on which species is blooming and also the light from the sun, which you can see here in an array of colors on this coast. And some algal blooms can glow in the dark. These bioluminescence is caused by chemical reactions actually within the algae, creating a mesmerizing light show in the ocean at night. However, during a red tide, it's usually best to avoid swimming inside the water. Toxins can cause skin irritation and hailing sea spray can lead to respiratory issues. And a more lasting effect is that red tides not only deplete the oxygen inside the water, but they also release toxins that accumulate in shellfish, making them dangerous to consume. Now on the flip side, some types of algae like this can pull nitrogen from the atmosphere and convert it into nutrients that act as a fertilizer, actually enriching the water water. So understanding the life cycle of these algae and the environmental triggers for these blooms help predict and potentially reduce their impact. Researchers use satellite imagery and water sampling like this here and computer models to monitor and forecast these red tide events. While red tides are a natural occurrence, awareness and research are key to minimizing their effects on our beautiful Southern California beaches.